So it's the top of the 10th and Will Myers is on second. And Profar hits this shot and watch him stare at it. He thinks that ball's gone. But then you realize it's a routine fly ball for Mookie Betts that Will Myers tags up on. And first of all, this is great base running. Because Will Myers could have easily just started drifting towards third so that he could score. But he stays disciplined and knows that if that ball's a homer, he's going to score anyways. So he tags up. And then we got Jorge Mateo at the plate. And literally three days ago, this guy was hit by two pitches in the same game, and they both look pretty painful. Which is why when he gets hit by the first pitch, he has this reaction. And the bench is clear because the pitcher and Mateo as well both get offended. But the best part of this brawl is when the bullpen's clear, and you see that red security guard running across the field. You know what he's doing? Look at this angle. There's some fan who ran onto the field, and I think he was trying to blend in with the Padres bullpen. But the security guard tackles him, and then you see that security guard again. He makes a second appearance. But eventually, we end up in a situation where it's runners on second and third with two outs and Trent Grisham at the plate. Now, notice the Dodgers' defensive alignment. You see all that green space on the right side of the infield? That's going to be important, because on a 2-0 pitch, Will Myers starts looking back at the third baseman. Now, why would Will Myers be looking back at where the third baseman is playing? Maybe because he's trying to get the biggest lead he can because, well, this happens. Now there's so much going on here that you guys might not see at first glance. First of all, Trent Grisham starts showing bunt literally milliseconds before the pitcher releases the ball. Now this shows just how brilliant the pitcher was and just how great his reaction time was because as soon as he sees this, he tries to hit Trent Grisham on purpose. Now this isn't because of the brawl, this isn't because of some beef, but it's because there's a base open. And if Trent Grisham gets this bunt down, with the way the defense is aligned, it's almost guaranteed a single that brings in Myers. Now what Trent Grisham could have done a little different is he could have held up and shown a little bit later. But honestly, I think the pitcher just played this really well. He ends up walking Grisham, but then he ends up striking out Tatis to end the inning. And if we fast forward a little bit, Corey Seager's at the plate, and these are his hard hit percentage hot zones. He doesn't have a single hard hit this season on pitches down and away, but he really loves the middle in. And as you can guess, Tim Hill misses the down and out pitch for middle in, and the Padres lose. Honestly, Dodgers played well. Mad respect to them. I know I make a lot of Padres content, but I honestly just love baseball. So if you love baseball, even if you're a Dodger fan, feel free to subscribe, feel free to like, feel free to join the Discord, feel free to follow the Twitter. I'll see you guys tomorrow.